What's up, everybody? It's Brian Ann Bean, the mentor to millions. And guess what? The time has come for you and I to work together personally. That's right. I'm going to text you myself after this video because I'm running a 120 10 campaign. Now, Brian, what's 100? 100 is normally the $100 it takes for our income shifting program. What's 20? Well, 20 is what it is right now for the next 10 days. Has money ever been the reason you and I didn't work together? Well, guess what? We've removed that barrier to entry. Everybody has $20. Don't tell me you don't, but you only have 10 days to take advantage. Click the link below. I will then email you or text you personally so we can take step two in the process of shifting your mindset and shifting your income. And until then, watch the two minute video that follows in case you forgot that we're teaching things that they never teach you in schools. And it's time for you too to learn the rules of the wealthy. Watch the next video, click the link below, and I'll text you or email you within 24 hours. All right, everybody, it's Brian Bean, founder of the Extra Digit Movement, and we are back. This is what? Video number three of our 30 for 30 financial challenge. That's right. We're going to help 30 families over the next 30 days start their journey to financial freedom. Now, in video one, I can't recap long, but I gave you guys two financial objectives that everyone in this country should meet. Your current lifestyle paid for by your labor. Your future lifestyle must be paid for by your investments. Something has to work, just not you. At some point, you're going to get tired of working. At some point, you don't want to work. At some point, you shouldn't have to work. But you have to have future investments in place so that one day you won't have to work. Now, video two was about one of the four challenges that keep you from meeting your financial objectives. It was about inflation, the silent income killer. It just goes into your income and drops it down every single day. Why? Because in this country, it's called free enterprise. Business owners can increase the cost of goods and services when they feel like it. It's not a bad thing. It's only a bad thing if your income is limited and you can't outpace inflation. Very few people calculate inflation when they try to get ahead of the curve financially. And it's something you must understand and it's something we teach you how to do. So today in video three, we're talking about the second challenge. There are four challenges. We're talking about challenge number two. Now, if inflation is the silent killer, man, guess what the chainsaw massacre is? Taxes. Taxes. Do you guys know that a lot of people try to budget their way out of a financial mess and you can't do it? You know why? The number one expense you have are your taxes. Let me give you an example. You make $50,000 a year. The government takes 18,000 off the top if you have a W-2. Then you take home 32,000. Now, where in the world are you seeing another $18,000 come off the top of your paycheck? It's not your shoes. It's not your clothes. Ladies, it's not your husband. Husbands, it's not your wife. It's not eating out. $18,000 went out the door before you even saw it. That's your biggest expense. It's your taxes. See, basically, guys, you work for the government on a W-2. Nothing wrong with a job, but you work for your boss and you work for the government. You work for the government for one third of the year because they take a third of your check. And I don't know about you, but when I learned that from January to April, I work for the United States government, that's when I fired my boss 20 years ago at the age of 22 years old because I realized, man, I can't work for my boss and the government. I'm not telling you to quit your job. What I'm telling you is understand that the government has carved their way into your life with taxes. Now, this is not about tax evasion. This is about tax minimization. In other words, you already got property taxes. You got sales taxes. You got ad valorem taxes. You got liquor taxes. You got state taxes. You got federal taxes. You got all these taxes. Do you know your income taxes are the one tax that you can control? because it's your income. So what we do, guys, is real simple. We teach you strategies, not sales, not hype. We teach you real strategies that wealthy people do that they just won't teach you in schools. 